Welcome back to Brutal Reviews. Today we're taking a brutally honest look at the TP-Link B3600 Wi-Fi 7 router. Now, at first glance, it looks solid, dual-band, Wi-Fi 7, for stream, quad-core processor, USB 3.0, and all those fancy ports and features. Many users swear by it for fast speeds, smooth streaming, and easy setup. On paper, it's everything your home network could want. But here's the kicker, some serious drama hiding behind that shiny exterior. Issue number one, random disconnects. Some users reported random disconnections. Like, one minute your Netflix is streaming in 4K, the next it's buffering like it's 2005. And yes, it's not just one-off cases. Issue number two, firmware bugs. Firmware updates are supposed to fix problems, right? Well, some updates actually introduce new ones. Laggy interfaces, drop settings, frustrating as hell. Issue number three, overheating. Multiple users notice the router gets really hot. Not just warm, hot enough that you might worry about leaving it on all day. And no, it doesn't come with a built-in fan. Issue number four, USB ports acting up. USB 3.0 and 2.0 ports look great on paper, but some users couldn't get external drives to stay connected. Files disappearing mid-transfer? Yeah, welcome to TP-Link Roulette. Issue number five, VPN issues. The built-in VPN sounds amazing until you realize it's not always stable. Some users couldn't maintain a secure connection without constant resets. Not ideal for home office setups. Issue number six, complex settings for beginners. TP-Link Home Shield, MLO, Easy Mesh, sounds fancy, but honestly, it's overwhelming for non-techies. A lot of users felt lost in the menus and settings. Issue number seven, price versus performance. Here's the brutal truth. For the price, some users expected flawless Wi-Fi 7 performance across large homes. And some reported weak coverage in certain rooms, which is disappointing considering the hype. So, should you buy the TP-Link B3600? Well, if you want cutting-edge Wi-Fi 7, multiple ports, and don't mind a few quirks, go for it. But if you want completely hassle-free performance, there are better options out there. My link is in the description if you're willing to roll the dice.